Hey guys, take control with the video for you guys. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to fix your iPhone if your iPhone is freezing or getting stuck in the call during a call that you're making. It happens sometimes if you're putting the phone on speaker and you can't touch the screen or it just simply locks up on you. How can you fix your iPhone screen freezing during a call? I'm going to show you. So first thing is when it comes to troubleshooting this issue is that we see sometimes there's some screen protectors that actually interfere with the display of your iPhone. So if you have any special screen protector, I recommend removing it and testing that out. But if you're stuck right now, the first thing you want to do is a force restart to get out of your phone from being stuck. So I did your force restart. It's going to be really simple. You're going to press and release the volume up, press and release the volume down one after another. So volume up, a volume down. Finally, hold the side button until the screen goes completely black and you see the Apple logo reappear. At that time, you'll let go of that button. So I'll do volume up, a volume down finally hold the side button and this method will work on iPhone 8 and above so on the latest iOS version as you can see here do not slide to power off that will be a normal shutdown you want to keep it holding the button until the screen goes completely black and the Apple logo appears just like that and that's known as a force restart which shuts down the phone and reloads the software of the phone so if it's a software related issue it will fix that problem for you and once you're back on your phone there's a couple other things you want to do so it doesn't happen for you again first thing is go ahead and slide up and close out the phone app and any other app that are running on your iPhone now after you have uh, done that the next thing you want to do is go into the setting of your iPhone go to general then go all the way down where it says transfer reset iPhone click on that and then you click on the first option to reset and we're going to want to do a reset of our network settings so if you do a reset of your network setting basically it resets things like saved wi-fi password any bluetooth connected devices and any issues you may be experiencing with the connectivity of your phone and this especially true when you're making calls because it's getting frozen and when you do that it can take about a minute or two and then once you're back on you'll be good to go and hopefully it doesn't freeze for you now still having the, if you're still having the issue the next thing you want to do is go ahead in your setting of your iPhone you're going to go general and iPhone storage you want to verify that you're not using up all of your storage on your iPhone because when you max out the storage of your iPhone as you can see I have 128 gig I'm using only uh, 14 gig but in a case that I was using 128 gig out of 128 gig I will need to go ahead and delete things like a larger videos some apps photos to clear up some space so that my phone doesn't have any performance issue and this is a one of the issues what happens is that because when the phone is full you present a lot of software related issues so you can go ahead and look at the recommendation Apple gives and start removing some clutter so that your phone is freed up with some space also another thing you might want to consider is that if you don't use the navigation utilities which is a default app on your iPhone some users have reported that the actual sensors or the gyroscope from the navigation app sometimes interferes with the phone's ability when it's on the cellular line so if you if you don't use it now if you use it of course keep it but go ahead and press and hold remove app and delete app and then click on delete and if you ever need it in the future you can always go back to the app store right and you can go ahead and re-download the default compass app so again it's something to consider and might be a fix for you again this is something we've seen with some users having that issue and lastly after you have done all that ensure that your phone is up to date with the latest software update by going to your settings general software update and if there's an update available it'll show up like this the reason why you want to do the update is that over time a previous update might have caused issues or glitches and Apple might have pushed out another update to fix those issues so that's why we want to ensure that our phone is up to date or the latest version so those issues can be resolved and you want to go ahead and update it give yourself about half an hour to 45 minutes so that update can happen successfully make sure you're connected to a Wi-Fi or a good strong cellular data during this process and your phone is at least 50 percent or more charged if not connected to a charger during the update and I hope going through all these troubleshooting steps help you guys fix your iPhone from freezing during call and it doesn't freeze anymore if so please make sure to like and subscribe button thanks for watching guys see you guys next time